Hi, I'm Bruce, and this is my family, Annie, Elsie, Betsy and Doug. And over a year ago, we quit the rat race in search of a simple, fulfilling and more sustainable life. Follow us on our learning journey towards living off-grid, self-sufficiency and cottage renovations. Hi everyone, and uh, welcome back to this week's video. This week we are going to be getting back on with the workshop build. So, with some help from my glamorous assistant, Mrs. Neil, uh, we're going to be whacking the purlins onto this building and getting ready for the sheeting to be going on. So, let's get going, babe. Let's get going! Pearl in one! <laughs> Pearl in one! <laughs> Okay, so I've kind of got as far as I'm going to be able to get today. I'm running out of daylight and I've got a shoot out now to go and collect a trailer, which I'm hopefully going to use to pick up some seconds uh, insulated roofing panels uh, on Rory's recommendation. So yeah, go and get some food and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Okay, it's an absolutely beautiful morning this morning. And the dream team are back together. Me and Rory are hitching up the trailer and heading off over to Leash to go and pick up some insulated roofing panels.
Okay, so we made it back and we've got the insulated roofing panels, uh, so that's going to make a massive difference. Right, I have a spare couple of hours today, so I'm going to try and get the lower purlins fitted on this shed before hopefully getting hold of some wheels for my scaffolding so that I'll be able to pull it around and do all of the roof timbers and get these insulated uh, roof cladding sheets up. Um, probably going to stay on this for about a week um, because um, for those of you that follow me on social media know that behind me there is 2,000 trees so um, I need to organise a bit of a gathering, a bit of a mahill, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right and get some friends and some of my local community over to help me plant those. But yeah, I'm going to use the rest of today to get this workshop as far along as I can. Okay, so I'm back and time is running away with me, but I have got uh, these cool kind of trolley caster wheels from Clairco to put on my quick stage scaffolding. So I've got to take down the scaffolding, put these wheels on, and then I can get these top purlins done. And that'll probably be me done for this week. Signature dance move. Yeah, people are going to ask to see that soon. I don't know what happened. It's a good move. Interrupting this bell to show you what the girls have been up to. What have you been doing, girls? Digging up potatoes. And this is what they got? I got all the white ones. Me and Mum got all the red ones. Great, what are you going to make with them? 
I don't know. Probably butter. Make potatoes and butter. Yeah. That's a great haul. It's a really good haul, considering we got blight and I had to chop all the leaves off. Yeah. Happy days. I hadn't realised I had a time lapse going and the uh, camera ran out of batteries. So this is as far as I got. Almost all the purlins are on now. Just have four more to fit, but I'm running out of daylight, so that's enough for today. Climbing up and down this scaffolding has absolutely worn me out and highlighted to me how unfit I actually am. I think I'm going to be very sore in the morning. Hey everyone, God, I've had a manic day today. I had to go and pick up a year, and because we live so remotely, uh, well, down the end of a the track, these trucks won't come down, so I had to go down with the trailer and, and unload it all by hand. So now I'm back on putting these purlins up, and uh, hopefully I'll get that done now. Because it's dragging on a little bit. <laughs> that even worse. So I've got all of the roof purlins on so that's ready for me to put the roof on uh, next week but I'm running out of time to get this week's video out so unfortunately sometimes you don't always get everything done that you uh, that you have planned but if you've not found this video too boring then don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you haven't already it would be great if you could subscribe and I'll catch you guys next week. Bye.